The Adrian and Blissfield Old Road Dinner Train. A train that runs between, as the name implies, Adrian and Blissfield. Popular for running the classic EMD GP9. This locomotive here, 1752, is dated all the way back to 1957, and is still used by the railroad to this day. And another GP9 on the rear of the train. In this video, we will be chasing this train from Blissfield and back, hitting many spots along the way, such as Blissfield, parts of Adrian, and many, many country roads. The train starts boarding at 5 p.m. and departs Blissfield at 6 p.m. sharp. After scouting out the area, we head over to our first spot as 6 p.m. rolls around to watch the train depart. Hearing every chime on that horn gradually get louder has got to be one of the coolest things ever. <laughs> This train highballing at only 5 miles an hour, mostly laughed upon by rail fans, but it is for the passengers to enjoy the scenery and countryside.
As we travel more into farmland, the wind was surely not on our side. As we catch up to the front of the train, we use the parallel roads to pace alongside the Adrian and Blissfield GP9. What used to be a diamond now serves as a rip track for the A and B. Here, the train made a quick stop so the conductor could pick up his DoorDash.
Somehow, I had pissed off God and he tried spawning a tornado right in front of me. This is as far as the train is going. It is going to start heading back to Blissfield, but this time with the green GP9 in the lead. Lenawee Junction is yet another piece of abandoned railroad history that is now used for railcar storage. This shot is absolutely beautiful, but had to be ruined by my phone's autofocus.
This would be the last shot of the day. Due to it getting pretty dark outside, you wouldn't be able to see much anyway. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed my neat little video here. This was the first time for me chasing the Adrian and Blissfield Railroad. I sure had fun. And if you guys want to see more videos like this and less Jeevos, please subscribe. Please.